mysterious criminal who calls himself the wrecker has wrecked the Hurricane Express and caused the death of the engineer. Larry Baker, who vowed to bring his father's murderer to justice, has captured Tom Jordan, a discharged employee of the railroad, whom he believes to be the wrecker. The capture of Jordan has removed Larry's former suspicions of Carlson, a railroad station agent whom he once believed to be the tool of the wrecker. Well, pretty soon I'll have the wrecker behind the bars. The man who murdered my father. Well, your clock must be slow, Carlton. I hear that train coming now. Why? That isn't the express. She didn't take it. Run away, Fox Car. She'll pass the express if we don't stop her. In the express? There's no chance now. I don't know how to thank you, Baker. You saved the Hurricane Express again. And this time, my life as well. Now, if there's anything I can do... Oh, forget it, Mr. Edwards. But who tied you up in that boxcar? Stratton, the escaped convict. Stratton? Yeah. I went out to meet him near milepost 59 to make a deal for the return of that gold shipment he stole from the Hurricane Express. He knocked me out. That's all I know. But it couldn't have been Stratton. It must have been the wrecker. What makes you think so? Because the wrecker, wearing a mask of you, met Stratton at the abandoned mine and tried to get the gold from him. And did he get it? No. But I got him. You got the wrecker? Who is he? Your former engineer, Tom Jordan. He's locked up in the station at Plainville. We must get there just as soon as we can. One of Walter Gray's transport planes. Yeah. I wonder why it landed here. Carlson, where are you? Jordan's escape and Carlson's disappeared. They must have got away in that plane. You mean 
You think Gray's mixed up with the wrecker? I've always thought so. He's the only person who could benefit by all these attacks on our railroad. Well, in that case, I'll go down to the airport and check up on that plane we saw. Good. I'll stay here until the dispatcher can send somebody out to take the place of Carson. to carry him to the car. You know where to take him? Yes, sir. Then you didn't find out where Stratton hid the gold. No, I had to make a quick getaway. What became of the mask? I don't know. Baker had it when the conductor locked me up at Plainville. Yeah, Baker's always throwing a monkey wrench into our plans. We'll have to take care of him. What are you spying around here for, Baker? Now you're a bit. Uh. Baker, get out of here, quick. I climbed snooping, sir. You've no right here, Baker. I came here to get Jordan, and you're not going to stop me. Did you find him? No, but I will. What do you want Jordan for, anyhow? He's a wrecker. Draw up a chair, Baker. Oh, well, you're working with a wrecker, eh? You're too fond of accusing people, Baker. Why, you've even accused me. As a matter of fact, you yourself were arrested as the wrecker and escaped from custody. I've been cleared of that charge. You don't say. Well, just the same, I'm going to hold you as an escaped prisoner. Take him, boys. Boys. Coming quiet, ain't you? you told me to take care of, sir. He disappeared. Disappeared? Yes, sir. When I got there, he wasn't in the car. <laughs> That's all right, Bates. Forget it. Yes, sir. Look at this sagebrush. The car's been in the desert, all right. Uh, Matthews, what in the world are you doing? Hello, Mr. Edwards. 
This is the car in which Stratton escaped from the abandoned mine. Are you sure? Whose car is it? It belongs to your secretary, Miss Martin. Impossible. You must be mistaken. Here's a registration certificate. She's mixed up with Stratton somehow. She must have gone out to warn him that we were planning to trap him. I'll go right upstairs and question her. I wouldn't do that, Mr. Edwards. If she doesn't know we suspect her, we can trail her and get Stratton. Uh, put that back, Hemi. Attention here. Oh, well, she's not likely to communicate with Stratton in the daytime. Oh, uh, can't you arrange with her to work nights so that we can watch her? That's a good idea. This must be the wrecker now. Wonder what he wants us for. Larry Baker is locked up in a storehouse at the airport. He knows too much. Okay, boss. Leave him to us. Hello? That's fine, Jordan. I'll be over there in a few minutes. I'll meet you near the roundhouse. Be sure to keep undercover. The railroad building.
What's the matter here? Who tied you up? Larry Baker. He took my uniform and drove the boss away. Where to? The railroad office. Come on. Wait here, Bates. Are you sure the girl knows where Stratton is? Yes, and we've got to act quick. The detectives are planning the trailer tonight. Uh, we'll have to get rid of them and follow the girl when she leaves. We must get hold of Stratton at any cost. Any chance of Baker interfering? <laughs> Not a chance. I've got him locked up over at the airport. Gloria! It's a wrecker wearing the mask of Mr. Edwards! Oh, 